Well, hello. It is Monday, April 29th. Woo, April's almost gone. <laughs> oh my goodness. Uh, so the morning sale has wrapped up. I have gotten uh, labels on packages ready to go. And we are going to talk about uh, the morning sale, what sold, what is still available. The still available, well, that is the buy it now portion of the video. There will be another one this afternoon in just a couple minutes on the video. But <laughs> I do two sales on Monday. So there will be another buy it now opportunity after the sale. So anything that does not sell, I will go through, I'll recap, I'll give you prices. Uh, today, we're, I'm going to give you numbers also. Um, if you're interested in any of the items, there will be a number and a price to make it easier to claim. Uh, if you want to claim an item um, to purchase it, you can send me an email or you can reply uh, or comment. There we go. Wow, it's Monday. You can comment below on the video. That works too. It really does. <laughs> All right, so for the morning sale, I brought 62 items. I sold 23, which means that 39 are still available. All right, so let's go over those 29 items that are available. I'm going to switch this around. All right, so today I had jewelry. I had scarves. Um, what else? Oh, I had one. I had a couple other things that weren't jewelry, but for the most part, jewelry. Uh, so we are going to start up front here with a pair of clip on earrings, silver tone clip on earrings. I do want to make a note that this is, um, it's a little stiff to move the, um, the clip-on part back and forth. So let me show you right there. Oh, you can see a little bit of me <laughs> in there. Uh, those earrings, $1, and they are number three. Uh, next, we have these silver tone earrings with little coins dangling from them. They are a hook style. Uh, these are $2, number eight. These hoop earrings, um, they're actually going to be sideways. And that's going to sound strange. But when you wear them, they're going to be more of a front and back design. And then you're going to see the design more on the side of your head than in the front. That makes sense? Sort of. Uh, these are $2, number 10. These little pink rhinestone stud earrings, they are silver tone. Beautiful little pink rhinestone in there. These are $2, number 12. These have a faux uh, turquoise stone on them, very Southwest style. Uh, these are $2, number 13. This little pair of silver tone post earrings, so they have a post. Uh, they have a little rhinestone right in the center. Those are $2, number 14. And then if you want to have some really cool retro red, white, and blue earrings for the 4th of July, these are clip-on style. They are $2, number 15. Um, oh, I lost my place there. All right, next up are these green earrings, silver tone hooks with this beautiful green. I've been trying to figure out if these are glass. They seem more glass than plastic, but I'm still not 100% on those. Uh, they are $3, number 18 for the green. These ones that are smoky colored, smoky gray, $3, number 19. 
These ones have an Aurora Borealis coating on them. So as it moves around, you can see it picks up the different shades of light. Uh, the light ones here are $3, number 21. And then you caught a glimpse of kind of the darker ones, a little more purple in those, but you can see they color change as the light hits them. Uh, those are $3, number 22. And I have a rock. Yep, this is a clear, kind of a clear rock. The little sticker, not very helpful, calls it a rock crystal. Well, I, I probably could have figured that one out. Little opalescence to it. Uh, that one is $3, number 23. And then this beautiful red pendant necklace that is a 17-inch a necklace with a 2-inch extender. And that is $3, number 26. Oh, and then up here, this is kind of an orange a plastic bead bracelet. You can see how pretty that is when the light hits it. Uh, that one, $3, number 28. All right, I've got some rings. Uh, this black one here is a size five and three quarters. And that is $4, number 29. The green, there we go, green, that is a size six, $4, number 30. Uh, the clear. Size seven and a half, four dollars, number 31. The purple, size seven, four dollars, number 32. The red, size seven, four dollars, number 33. The yellow is a size nine, four dollars, number 34. The champagne, size eight and three quarters, four dollars, number 35. The olive green, size nine and a half, four dollars, number 36. The red marquee, size nine and a half, four dollars, number 37. And then this one, which is not a stone, but it really looks like it, a rose gold tone. And then it does have a little ivy or like leaf design. I don't know, kind of ivy kind of leaf design on the side. That one is really sparkly. Uh, size eight and three quarters. And that rose gold one with black is $4, number 38. This is a stone, a real stone bracelet in clear, $4, number 39. And then the reddish brown, uh, $4, number 40. Uh, this lovely gold tone bracelet with the clear rhinestones on it, that is a, a seven and a half inch bracelet. $4, number 42. Uh, let's see, where are we going next? The ring. This one is a purple center ring. Gold tone with clear accents. It is a size 6. There you go. Size 6 on that one. And it is $5, number 44. The yellow one, gold tone with yellow and clear, size eight and a quarter, five dollars, number 45. And this one, green with um, clear around, size 10 and a quarter, and that is five dollars, number 47. Um, 
Oh, I missed the blue. Okay. Oh, I missed the blue necklace. All right. Silver tone blue pendant necklace. That is a seven, 17 inch necklace with a two inch extender. That was $4, number 43. And then we have the yellow necklace. That is a 17 inch necklace, no extender. And that's $5, number 49. The green stone, it's almost like a teal, isn't it? Like a teal color. Various shades from light to dark. That one is $5, number 50. The multicolored stone bead bracelet with a druzy pendant. That's $5, number 53. And then, oh, then we're going to do the scarf. Uh, this scarf with the purple magnolias. Uh, let's see, that one measures 56 inches by 19. That's $5, number 55. This one with the orange and pink stripes. This is 68 by 42 inches, and it's $6, number 57. This beautiful blue and purple, got a little fringe on it. It is 72 by 26 inches, $7, number 58. Uh, the flower brooch, that is a rose gold tone with clear flower petals, uh, pink rhinestone petals, and a pearl bead center. $8, number 61. And then this really cool boho scarf with all the colors, all the designs, and fringe. 70 inches by 40 inches, and that is $8, number 62. Whew. All right, so those are the 39 items that are still available. Let's take a look at the 23 items that sold. Uh, this is a blue sandstone. I'll put that in the light. Isn't that one pretty? Oh, that is so nice. Uh, some of the bracelets, the stone bracelets. Some really cool vintage clip-on earrings. I had some heart brooches. And then the scarves, a blue floral, a purple floral, and a paisley. All right, let me uh, flip this around. Ah, the sun is out. So pretty when the sun is out. Uh, all right, next steps for me, uh, the sold items. I'm going to take those upstairs. The still available items, um, I'm going to kind of put those in bags and keep them down here and available for me to get to. And um, we are then, once the table is clear, then I'm going to start setting up for the sale. Uh, for the afternoon, but we're going to head up to the front door and we're going to talk about the postage and boxes and everything that are going out today. All right, I am up by the front door and I'm going to show you the packages that are going out today from the YouTube sales. So I have got eight packages in total and there's Faye chilling out in the chair. Uh, eight packages heading out today. I have 11 packages in my hold area. Um, I also do have the labels ready for the eight big boxes to go out. Uh, I am going to have to check and see how much room <laughs> is in the mail carrier truck. Now I know they do not have unlimited space. Uh, so I'm going to talk to, to the, whoever picks up today, whether it's my regular or, um, or another one and see how many boxes of that. 
uh, see how many boxes they are able to take today. And then the rest of those should go out tomorrow. Um, but yeah, I know he's probably not going to have enough room to take all eight boxes, I don't think. Um, unless for some reason today he's emptied out the truck by the time he gets here. Um, but we'll see. And I will, um, well, you'll see tomorrow how many are left over. Um, so what these are, if you missed what these big boxes are, uh, they are clothing. I have a lot of clothing uh, to list on eBay. Um, really nice stuff. And I, uh, I have no time. <laughs> I have tried and tried and tried to work in some time. And I tend um, to make more excuses because I do not like taking pictures of clothing. Now, having said that, there are some pieces I am hanging on to because they are a very simple pair of shorts, a very simple skirt, a simple tank top type thing. Um, so yeah, there are some that I am hanging on to uh, because those I can photograph easily. But when you start getting into tops and pants and dresses and stuff, I I have photographed a lot. I do have a lot listed. I have sold a lot in my eBay and Poshmark stores. Uh, I just I just don't have the time. And getting assistance with um, listing this, I'm hoping then does motivate me to get the shorts the skirts, the tanks, the hard goods that I have here, that I won't keep making mental excuses on why I can't do these. And I will just get the other done as I have a couple minutes here and there to spare. And I can just like take a couple pictures, list a couple items, kind of back to where I was like a year and some ago when I was able to get two or three done a day. I would like to be able to go back to doing that where I can do two or three a day just on my stuff. So that's why I am getting some assistance with this other because it kind of does help free up that like mental block, I think anyway. We'll see. We'll put it to the test. We'll see how I do now that we're heading into summer, right? We're getting close. I know some people are still wrapping up winter with the little bits of snow that they're getting, but I'm, I'm kind of gearing up towards, all right, we're, we're, we're getting close to heading into summer now. Um, so again, we'll see how many boxes he's able to take today. And then the other eight packages, um, are ready to go out. And thank you all so much for your payments. I appreciate it. And those of you who have contacted me and let me know what's going on um, in your world, I appreciate that too. And yeah, so I am now going to go and get working on the table, uh, get that done, and um, then start setting up for the afternoon sale. So I will probably see you again um, unless I get another payment in, but I will see you again after the sale. All right. Well, it is after the afternoon evening sale. And oh, first, let me update you on the mail. Uh, so my mail carrier was able to fit uh, six of the boxes in the truck. So I am left with just two boxes for tomorrow's pickup, plus all the other mail uh, that was picked up. So that was pretty awesome. You know, those those trucks aren't very big, but um, but I am very happy that he was able to get uh, six of those boxes in the truck. That was awesome. Uh, so look for those two to be going out tomorrow. And those are the big boxes of clothing. All right. Um, so for the um, evening afternoon sale, uh, we brought 15 items 
to the sale, I sold six of the items, which means nine are still available. And that is the buy it now portion of, of the afternoon sale, evening sale, depending on your time zone. <laughs> uh, let me flip around. All right, and here we go. Here are the items that are still available. Uh, let's go ahead and go through them. Up first is this little, I believe it is a five inch plate. It is part transfer, part uh, hand painted. That is from Germany and that is $4. The milk glass, grapes and leaves, salt and pepper shakers, uh, very clean, very clean on the inside. Uh, those are $6 for the pair. This beautiful blue and white plate from Mexico, I think that one was nine and a half inches. That is $11. This little stone carved puppy. I'm not sure what kind of stone that is. It's a very creamy color with some red veining through it. There is the little puppy's face. Uh, let's see, that is $12. This pedestal bowl with a beautiful fruit design. Uh, that one is $9. This picture by, um, oh, Montague, Montague, Miss Many Lambs. The frame on this one is 13 and a half by 10. It does have a little wear on the frame and that is $15. Uh, this little piece of art, it is a bird's nest, but it's more art than functional. Uh, that one is $12. This is a set of four plates. They are from Czechoslovakia, Bohemia, Czechoslovakia. I believe the gold part on here is hand painted. These do not look like they have ever been used. There is a set of four of them and they are $20. And then this glass bowl, hard to believe this is a glass bowl. Um, there are a couple of chips on the bottom. There's that one and then there is a larger chip right here. This is an Art Deco bowl by George Davidson. Beautiful glass bowl and that is $15. Um, all right, so those are the nine items that are available. The six items that sold on um, this beautiful, also from Germany, rose platter. Um, I had a larger tile and a smaller tile. This blue and white bowl, uh, that is Asian. I'm not sure if it's Japanese or Chinese. And then this teacup and saucer from Italy has birds on it. Um, oh, there's the birds. And then this piece of stone which is, oh gosh, I'm not going to remember the name of it. Um, lepid, lepidolite. <laughs> I know that's not how you say it. Lepidolite. <laughs> it is a purple stone. All right. So those are the six items that sold. I'm going to flip the camera. All right. Uh, so I am going to uh, take the sold items upstairs. 
the items that are still available, I will be keeping them down here so I can access them in case anybody watches the speed round or watches this vlog and is interested in purchasing any of those items. Uh, once I get the table cleared off, I am going to go ahead and get set up for uh, the morning sale. I did already have a little light dinner, so I'm good to go there. Um, and I'm just going to, yeah, just work until I crash, <laughs> which actually is not going to be too much longer. <laughs> Um, but that is going to wrap things up for today. So thank you so much for watching and I will see you tomorrow.